I want something to blow up. The most important element in a good story is conflict. It's that tension that to me makes a great story. It's seeing two opposing forces collide with one another that we have story. Impact, you know, so to tell a story that has the potential not only to entertain but also to educate and inspire, those are the stories that we look for. I, I found that one of the most helpful things you can do is just step back for a second and ask yourself what's the truest thing. Honesty and grace because the you know one without the other doesn't work. The authenticity of the story is of prime importance. A story has to like ev evoke, oh yeah, that's me too. And I'm not talking about fiction versus nonfiction, but that rings true as a, as, a, as a true experience or something that could be a true experience is important. The most important element of a great story is vulnerability. Like the storyteller's willingness to be open, to tell on themselves, to not necessarily be the hero of their own story. Uh, to, to feel as if something's real, to feel as if it's authentic and coming from somebody's heart, they, you know, their heart has to be open a little bit. The most important element of a great story, story I guess, is the audience. You know, uh, a great story told in the desert on a recording with nobody hearing it is kind of meaningless. I don't know if you watched Up, but, but in the movie, like after five minutes, they grow old and she dies and it's an animated movie but I cried like a little girl. The, the, the commonality of the human condition is what is the core of, the, of, of great stories. We all encounter these moments all the time in our lives like we'll be standing in line at the grocery store and overhear a bit of dialogue and something in that sentence will strike us as somehow true. When you come across the true story it, it's like glowing in a way. It's almost like a seed. It can be an image, it can be a sentence, it can be a bit of dialogue. Sometimes you start with an image or a sentence. Uh, it's all kind of like a voodoo thing. It's like remembering a dream. Uh, you dream something at three o'clock in the morning and you say, I am going to remember that. I can't wake up and write it down because it's too tough, but I'll remember it. And then eight o'clock comes or seven o'clock or whatever as you wake up and what was that dream?